you know, Thespa 2013 is coming up. Um, it's the big one for us. I've got quite a few stands that I need to build for it. Um, I've got basically three conference theatres, a couple of, um, sort of warning uh, areas for exhibiting items on, on the walls. Varying sizes, and we can talk about that a bit in a bit more detail, but in essence, I want something that's prettier um, than a, a bit of shell scheme with a, a graphic stuck on it. Um, ideally, maybe a continuous graphic, so there's no really obvious like, optimal pole joins or anything like okay, that, yeah. um, where we can. Um, and yeah, just want them to be a bit different, um, ideally sustainable if possible as well. Yeah, Maybe but the sorts of suggest. things that um, we're doing at the moment are fabric stretched over wooden frames to create uh, a banner wall, mm -hmm. that sort of system. We are able to clad existing shell ski, a bit like in this example, okay. so individual uh, panels all joining up to create one seamless graphic all the way along the, the, the feature wall, mm. so that's effective. Um, but I was thinking, because you were talking about adding in some some shape and some yeah. interest to this, maybe we could look at doing some of the honeycomb scented boards, okay. um, which we can contour cut. Yeah, definitely. No, that yeah. Looks, looks really nice. And again, if we can connect the, the panels together, we could add some interest with cutting shapes into the board. Um, I mean, this example is reboard, but um, I mean, we could we could think about that, creating something that was structurally freestanding mm. but also had shape in it as well, so get, get okay. quite creative with it. <laughs> 